Hey everybody, I'm going to show you real quick how to use EasyBib. Okay, so I'm here in my head rush and I'm working on my project called How to Recover a Broken Knee. And now it looks like I'm on my notes and my bibliography. And when I click on bibliography, it says you can use EasyBib to create a bibliography for any resource you use as a resource for your project, as research for your project. Open a blank Google Doc, click add-ons, then click Easy Bib Bibliography Creator, and then click Manage Bibliography, okay? So, I'm gonna go to my Google Drive, which if you don't know how to get there from your email, click the nine boxes. You can go Drive or Docs, either one. I prefer Drive, just because that's where everything is. The new Google Docs, click there. And then always be sure to title it Chris Fake Bibliog Four Bone Project. Okay. Now it said add ons, get add ons. Then if you search the apps, Easy Bib should pop up pretty quickly. So you click on EasyBib, see seven million people have used it, then just click install. It'll say, I need your permission, you click continue, pop up a thing, which account, your Avalon account, allow, just a few little clicky clicks that you need to click through. Uh, okay, tells me where it's to be found. All right, so it should be found here in add-ons, easy bib, manage bibliography. Okay, now over on this side, it says to cite a source, okay? So I found a magazine source, three biotech solutions for knee repair. So I'm gonna take the URL right here, I'm gonna copy it, control C, and I'm gonna come over here, it's not a book, uh, it's not a journal article, it is a website. Now maybe journal article would work because it's a magazine, so I can try that, but I'm not sure that it's gonna work. That looks a little bit funny. Nope, that's not what I want. So what I want is I want website. So I'm gonna paste it here. That looks much better. All right, and I'm actually gonna go to APA style. I'm going to try that again. Sorry. Three biotech solutions for knee repair. I click select. Because that's the one I want. And then I click add bibliography to doc. And what happens is it does all that fancy difficult uh, formatting for me. Now you can do all that stuff manually if you want to. Um, but I think that it is much easier to use EasyBib. So I hope this video helped you uh, use EasyBib. Have a great day, everybody.